Hi everyone, Dennis Foley from Acoustic Fields. Today we're going to talk about noise guessing. I just cannot believe the misunderstanding and the level of misunderstanding with noise that's out there. I wish I could record and play back some of the things I hear every day regarding noise. 95% of it is wrong and won't work. Noise transmission is the most least understood part of physics and, and room acoustics that we deal with. I, I think we can safely say that. It's just, people just have no idea what works. They've read a little bit about this or that on the internet. They're looking for an easy, cost-effective solution with noise, and there isn't any. So most of the things you read on the internet probably won't work for your particular situation unless you know what your situation is. And then when you know what your situation is, you have to then select the proper material types and construction methodology. Both have to work together. Knowing what materials to use is just as important as knowing how to build it. Okay? So I want to look at this email that we received. And I'm going to pull it up here and just take a moment, read through it, look at the level of detail the customer is processing information with. Okay. Let's look at some of his tactics that he's using because there's no strategy. If there was a strategy, we'd have numbers. We know what we're fighting. We know how big the enemy is, how many people it has that we have to fight. We would have all of the problem defined. Problem, solution. You never want to start with tactics first. That's what you do second after you get your noise numbers first. Without noise numbers, you don't have a roadmap. You don't have GPS. You don't have direction. You're just putting band-aids on things without knowing how bad they're bleeding. And you won't stop the bleeding. Let's look at some of the tactics. Window plugs, drywall, fiberboard, molding, stripping, air gap, styrofoam. Lots of different tactics. Each one has a different frequency and amplitude that it works with. Drywall is different than styrofoam. Window plugs, whatever that is, is different than using air as a barrier technology. Air can be a barrier material type. Air can be a tactic if you have noise numbers and know what you're fighting. It's just one more tactic material type in our bag our toolbox, if you will, that we use. It has validity in some cases, not many, but in some cases, and not the way they represent it on the internet. This double wall, green glue nonsense is a waste of space and a waste of materials and won't even work below 100 cycles. Okay? I get calls every day from people who use that methodology and are calling me, complaining. And I said, why are you calling me? You said, you, on the internet, it said it would fix your room. Well, it's a theater room. I go, oops, first mistake, low frequency issues you didn't measure. So you used all this material, all this labor, and it won't work. And it's not working, or you wouldn't be calling me. If it was working, you'd be happy, and there would be no need for our phone call. So, how do we fix it? Most cases, we have to tear it out. It's an adage, old adage in carpentry that we use in our shop. Measure twice, cut once. I say measure three times, cut once. There's reasons for that, too. All right. Every material type is frequency and amplitude dependent. Frequency and amplitude dependent. If you don't have your noise numbers, if you don't have the frequency and the amplitude of the problem, you can't use a tactic. I can tell you what frequency these, all these materials will stop. 
but I don't know the frequency. I don't know the noise. I don't know the strength of it because I don't have any numbers. Okay? No numbers. You're guessing. Guessing with noise is a fool's game. You'll guess wrong every time. I even guess wrong sometimes. I've been doing this 40 plus years. What chance do you have? Zero. Measure, measure, measure. Once you measure, I can solve your problem in five minutes and send you a drawing of what to build, and I'll guarantee it that it'll work. No guessing. If you do the numbers right, if you don't, you do them over and we'll get it right for the second time. It's no problem. But we need a map to run on. We need, we need a you know, GPS to guide us. Physics is the law. Everything else is a suggestion. Remember that. Physics is the law. Everything else is a suggestion. This is all a suggestion. And 80% of it won't work. Okay? In most situations. So, noise guessing, don't guess with noise. Measure, measure, measure. And we'll get it right. I'll guarantee it. It'll be 100% fixed and 100% right. Hope this helps. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video. And if you liked it, please give us a thumbs up. We also have a newsletter that you can subscribe to. So please do that because we offer special price discounts to only those on our newsletter. And then don't forget about our forum. We have started a forum on our own website where people ask questions and I usually get a chance every couple days to look at it. There's an interchange between people on the forum and we'll give you real answers uh, on a regular basis, so that'll help you. Thank you.